Hello, this is take two now. Uh, Cats O-Gage Layout, the Bancroft Watson Railroad, and this is episode number 35. Today we're going to do a video, an unboxing video as you can see, and there's the bridge that we got and this thing that I did the video early on for. And there's Tammy, my assistant. Hello, all you wonderful train people. Hope yeah. you enjoy this. And here we go. We're going to start again. As you can see, it's got all this stuff written on the side. It comes in this nice box. And it's got the green train. It's ready to run O-Gage remote train set. It's a Lion Chief, as you can see. Now, all the things on my layout are Lion Chief run by the Lion Chief remotes. I don't have Legacy, nor TMCC, nor anything else on the layout. I don't even have conventional. It's all Lion Chief right now. Okay, now we're going to take the lid off the box. And we're going to place it over here to the... Let's place it over to the side. Anyhow, um, there's the uh, directions, and there's those little plastic things, I couldn't figure out what they are, and there's the remote, and it's got the lane chief remote, oh, there's the remote, and there's the power pack, and there's the caboose, and you see it's got all that written on the side of it, Silver Bell Express, and there's the tender, it's got this nice picture on the side, and... There's the uh, train, and and so the dog is trying to interrupt our filming. I wanted him to stay off this time because we have so much stuff. All right, let's lift this out of here this time. All right, and put that there, and the box goes over here. As you can see, there's track in the back of the box, and... Uh, Inside this, there is this item and these items. Um, I, I, I'm going to leave these in here right now because it's just a lot of stuff. And there's two cars. If you tip it this way, tip it, tip it this way. Right, without tipping it over all the way. Stop. Don't tip it over all the way. Anyhow, there we go. And I'll wow. come over here. And we can see there's the Silver Bear car and the box car. It's supposed to do some lighting up like possibly the high Halloween trains do. I'm not really sure, but we'll see. It's supposed to play music and stuff. We will see. Okay, so yeah. we'll put this box piece back in here. And we'll put this on. And we'll pick it up and we'll set it back into the train box. There we go. And we can put the lid on it now. Because we're going to shove it to the back so we can do all the other things we've got to do today. And there we go. And next we got this, which is a um, fast track right hand, a left hand, excuse me, switch. This will complete the Candy Mountain loop that lights up. Of course, this part don't light up. And now Tammy will open that very gently. Um, now I will check this. No, you need to open the other side, Tammy. And she's going to be opening this up now. Very gently. Because it's a manual switch. And normally there's a... Very gently. I am. There is a plastic thing that slides in here. Stop, stop, all right, and then what we do is we open it up because of that little thing right there. Those break off so easy. I don't know why they designed them this way, but very gently take the cover off. Don't put any pressure on the switch, and we'll get this. As you can see, the switch mechanism moves the track pieces, and you got to Keep that piece intact because it's really hard to put back on if it gets broken. Now that can be put up on top of there. That can get put up on. 
Here's some trap pieces. I got a half 36R, and of course, by the way, this is a 36R. And a four or five inch piece, I'm not really sure. This is a third or a quarter 36R. And a one and three eighths inch uh, breaker piece. As you notice, these are all dirty. They really need to be cleaned, so I'll, that's a project I'll have to do. But for the price that I paid for them, like I said, he's very reasonable. And the prices are pretty cheap. So let me move this stuff over. I'll move all this over. And we'll get that there. And the next thing, as you've seen, we had this item. So we'll put that up there for right now. And then we have some cars in this bag. Oh, and by the way, there were batteries in the train. We just didn't put them back in. There we go. And now Tammy's going to be taking out the car. That, there's a bicentennial car. Tip it up a little bit. There you go. It's a nice little car. It lights up, by the way, and everything. Okay, you can just put it right there. And... As you can see, I got it for ten dollars. You can't beat that. And then there's a gondola. And this is a little bigger than I put on my layout. I like the ones that are slightly shorter, but I love the orange color. I think that's great. And we can put that on the track over there. Okay, I guess it could be there. Just leave it there. And Tammy's taking out the next one. And she's going to open this box up. I'm sorry, I can't get back far enough to get her in most of the time. It's uh, We're in a front room of our apartment because I have trains in the back of one. And she has stuff there. Now so you can put that box up on top of the train box. And this is a bluish green. Maybe even close to turquoise. Gondola, can you tip it up a little bit? There you go. See, it says Lionel Lines, like the black one I have. Okay. So that's another car. And now we'll go over here and we'll get some, uh, another set of train cars. There. And while she's opening that up, I'll uh, move these out of the way over to here. And... I'll move these. Definitely yes, these are passenger cars. And these are called heavyweight passenger cars. And you can tip it up on its side. There you go. That way you can see the words. New York Central. Century Limited. And that is the combo car. It does the baggage and it's got some space in there. And there's actually people on the side of it. It's hard to see. Yep, see, and supposedly they light up. I haven't tested these. He said he did, and they did light up. So, here we go. Here's the next one. Now, this is a passenger car. Please turn it a little bit sideways. There you go. A little more. See, there's Sentry Limited. There's, with the, these phone cameras, you got to tip the cars up. So I, they lighten up and I can actually see what I'm filming. And there you go. That's a passenger car. And please put it down. And there we go. We got another pair of cars here. Now three of the cars actually have um, couplers. One of the car has fixed couplers. So I guess I'm going to have to... Uh, Tell them pardon me for my shakiness. Yes. Pardon her for her shakiness. She's diabetic and... Sometimes she shakes. Now let's tip the car. Let's tip the car. That just says New York Central. And put the car over there. And let's get back to the other car and get it out of the bag. And again, tip it up so I can see it. There we go. It's another New York Central. And this is the one with the... Uh... Oh, this one down here has the... It's the observation car, and this is another passenger car. And I'll take that one from you and put it over here. So we'll put it here. And next we got this bag of stuff, and we need to go through it quickly. So, turn it 
turn it around so I can see the front sign. So there's a house that actually lights up. I got this at the Dollar Tree, believe it or not. Dollar and, and a quarter tree. Yes, it's a dollar and a quarter tree now. And then we got this um, uh, gingerbread uh, candy shop or sweets and chocolates. All right, please put it down there. Let's do this quickly. All right, now we've got um, fencing. If I hold those up so I can see the whole thing. Hold it up so I can see the whole thing. There you go. All right, it's got a wreath on it. All right, and it's got some other things on it. Just put them over there for right now. And there's one more. So we got three of those. Those are for the two houses on the way out. And let's see what else is in the bag. Oh, glue. we got glue. We need glue. Walmart's not carrying their big bottles of glue, so that's really a problem. Um, I think they're deliberately doing it because they charge more for the little ones, so I buy my glue there. Three of these make a big bottle of glue. Okay, now I'm going over here. This is the bridge. It's metal. It was used. I only paid 20 for it. I tested a car on the track on it. It seems like it's going to fit and everything. I was wonder I was a little worried about that at first, but it's only going to have a single track on it. It's going to go in front of the window. And as I said, I got this too. And so here's a view of all the stuff and everything. So and there's Tammy. Bye. Wave and say goodbye, Tammy. Enjoy. Yes, and here's our, our dog, uh, Bucky, the wonder dog. He's kind of sulking oh, because yeah. we wouldn't let him up on the bed this time. Okay. All right. Thank you very much. Please like and subscribe. Tammy's picking up some of the stuff right now. And I'll put this video up later today. It is Saturday, the 5th of November. Again, please like and subscribe. This is episode 35. Thank you all for watching my videos. I do appreciate you. Please comment when you can. If you got any suggestions, let me know. You all take care. Love you all. Bye. Tammy. Bye. 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 Okay. Enjoy.